Right. Hey, Mike did the job. He just pulled the Aaron house. He gave him the cash saw there, so shit groovy now. He said he wanna talk, but can they do it in the house? They walked in, he said, what's up? And then you hear, yeah, that's a gunshot, nigga. Mike had to off that nigga. Ray dead, but he still paid him. Michael Hunt is God, and that's a fact, nigga. He gon' move on from that nigga, cause he got better shit to do. He looked around, ain't nobody that he shot. And again, did he made a move? Mike pulled up the his crib, shit, low kids, where nobody live. He got the shit when he left Kelly, it's a man crib, look how he live. He turned the kid, and then he walked in. His bro dad, he got a big grin. He told Mike, bro, have a seat. He gon' tell Mike he might have a kid, and he did that. He said, Mike, you might have a son. Mike said, nigga, what you mean? He showed him the phone, then the phone rung. He gave it to him, it's his homie one. He picked up, like, what up, bro? He said, I got the info you needed. He said, send it, now we bout to go. Bro said, Mike, I'ma make a long story short. That Kelly bitch you had, had a boy. She came up getting money now and made it out the struggle that you left for. We gon' go by and get my boy. He looked into it and the shit true. Mike said, who they said the daddy is? His brother said, the street said, Jew. So they pulled up. Mike brother knocked at the door. Kelly looked out the peep hole. Mike brother wasn't there no more. Mike is standing at the other door. He got a gun, ain't they scared to pop it? He told his niggas come closer to him. He gon' talk to him to make sure they got it. He told him, look, I'ma say this once. Shit about to get real now. In and out, we can't take forever. It's a kid in there, so no guns out. I'm sorry we ain't get to talk this out. Listen to me when I'm talking now. I'm going in without making sounds. I'ma let you in and then it's going down. They crept around the side. It's go time, bitch. Fucked up thing and no sneaking on or living in apartments. Moments later, Mike Bard stand from the back of the door on some smart shit. She had time, so she kinda hid, so he walked past and didn't notice it. So Mike walked to the front door, ain't nobody there, so he fucked up. He went and let two niggas in, and they rushed through the door, masked up. They in the house, turn a bitch up. Mike wanna be the bitch up. The niggas really looking everywhere. They really trying hard to find a son. Kelly crept out of spot. Woo, woo. Mike looking with his Glock. Woo. This shit crazy, and niggas really made a mess. Woo. Woo. But Kelly got him off, and it only clean up ops. Hey, Mike in the room from his bros. He hear steps and they creep in. He peeped out, and it's the Kelly bitch. She look like she about to meet them. She turned the corner just to greet them. Mike crept out, he on the same shit. Then Mike hears his homie scream, Mike. Kelly starts shooting like it's game six. That's all you hear from inside the room. He know the daddy still want the kid, but he gotta go. Then he bumped into him. Trey was about to take off from Mike. Mike grabbed him, and you know that's nice. Mike dragged Trey down the stairs at the same time his brother lost his life. Shit crazy. Trey fighting Mike ass back, but Mike got him in a fucking car. He told him, chill, sit your ass back. He left a crib on a fast sack. Kelly realized it's someone else, but went to grab Trey out the closet, came out the room, and no one there. Mike got the kitty in the back seat. Mike told him, Look, don't you be scared of me. It's all good, it's gonna be alright, my G. Justice has to be served, and the judge is the streets. And your mama played foul, and now she fouled out. You part of her team, and she let her team down, cause you need her right now. But fuck it, that shit over with. You don't need to hear that, so let's talk about some other shit. What's your name, nigga? The kid said, Trey. Mike said, You like football? Trey said, I play. Mike said, What position? Trey said, Running back. Mike laughed and said, I'll tie you up so ain't no running back. <laughs> he looked back, Trey ain't laughing at all. Trey said, Look, man, where the fuck is my mom? Where she at, nigga? Hate you almost fat, niggas. Mike cut him off like, Fuck you. Sit back, nigga. Trey sat back and he looking out the window. Cracked it just a little. Bit. He need to feel that wind blow Thinking about his mom, he know he dead He heard them things blow Who he gonna live with? Cause they ain't got no kin, folks Fuck this, Trey ain't on no duck shit Yeah, he got a plan They approached the red light Trey got out and ran Mike tried to stop him Trey small, so he slapped his hand and moved quick Trey a running back He used to stiff arm in that bullshit He ran through a yard Then he bust him a right Closed the gate door behind him Yeah, he made it look right Check the back door of the house It's not a person in sight He bust another right Then fuck, he ran it to Mike, damn, Mike took this nigga back to the car, he said, why you run, Trey said, I don't know who you are, you just took me out my house and said you gonna kill my mama, and you doing this stuff for nothing, she ain't never in no drama, Mike said, look kid, it's clear that you don't really know her, Trey cut him off and said, man, I know my mama blow a bitch, 
And I ain't dumb, I'm seven years old And you by 30, so you should know just how this go You just kidnapped me, so my mom gon' pull up And if she dead now, then my uncle show up Then you'll look crazy and realize you screwed up You'll shoot, he'll shoot, then the corners roll up, right? Mike laughed and said you don't know what this thing bout See, this a different kind of sport, you don't know what this game out See, what your mama did was... Fuck! The car came Fuck, to a stop, cause shots rang out